Greetings everyone. Happy New Year. It is 2013. Oh my gosh. I can't believe it. I honestly cannot believe it. Okay guys, so I am here to just say Happy New Year from me personally. Um, it is a new year. Can you guys believe it? I mean, 2012 was, it was a learning experience definitely was a learning experience. Um, lots of lessons learned, lots of tragedies, um, lost two friends. Um, my, my, my. It just, it amazes me and it just makes me so, so humble and so thankful for God's grace. Like people are dying at a very young age. I'm 24 and a lot of people didn't make it to see that age last year. You know what I mean? Not even to see Christmas or... It just makes me so thankful, thankful to God that I made it. Um, so we are in a new year. This is 2013. And I am not about New Year's resolutions because I feel like I never follow through with them. But it's like it's like going to the gym you go for the, you know the beginning and it's like oh yeah I'm going to the gym and you're pumped up and everything and then you're just like okay why exactly am I here again yeah so I don't I don't believe in New Year's resolutions but what I will say is for 2013 I would like to try something a little different now, as you guys know, I always say that I'm going to watch what what comes out of my mouth because your words are powerful, people. I always say I'm going to watch what I say, but I'm honestly going to put a hundred... I'm going to try with everything in my power to try to put 110% into watching what comes out of my mouth. You know, you want to speak prosperity over your life. Like, a lot of times we get upset and we get frustrated and we're just like... It could be the simplest thing to the point where you get up and you get out of bed and you're like, Oh my gosh, I'm tired. It's going to be a bad day. That right there, that right there is a problem, okay? That's what I'm talking about when I say speak positively. So... With that being said, that's one thing that I definitely want to go into effect with 2013. Um, I want to start speaking more positively, and I want to see the manifestation of my words. So, yeah, um, I believe my biggest thing, my biggest concern with Naisha is renewing my mind. That's what I want to do, because if I can renew my mind, and I can be, I can be transformed. Okay, <laughs> I'm right, repeating the word of God. Be transformed by the renewing of your mind. I don't want to just know what they say. I don't want to just read what it says on the paper. But I really, really, really want to feel it and I want to experience this in my life. You know what I mean? So, yeah, that's basically what I'm doing. So, um, yeah, be transformed by the renewing of your mind. And... I just want God to really transform me and really create in me a clean heart and a right spirit. That's what I really, really want for 2013. Because my heart's desires is to have, you know, I want to have a lot of things in this year. I want to see a lot of things manifest in this year. But if I can assure that I will be obedient even when it hurts, even when I don't see things happening, even when I don't know where he's coming from, the left or the right, if I can remain obedient, even when it hurts. Let me say that again. Even when, as you guys know, I told you that I colored my hair and it didn't come out to the color that I wanted. So I ended up recoloring it again. And that's the color that you guys see right now. I don't know if it's going to show up properly on camera. On camera, I believe it's giving off more of an, an orange kind of a tint, perhaps. But it's not exactly that orangey. Let me see if I can show you guys. I don't know if the camera's going to give it the proper color, but I'll po post pictures. But this is the second color that I put in. It's much lighter, and it's 
very much so the color that I wanted. Um, yeah, that's about it, guys. Um, as far as my hair being dry from the dye, I haven't experienced that because I'm taking very good care of my hair. Um, so that's all I have to say. Happy New Year.